So welcome guys to another video. Today I'm going to be showcasing how to make a custom ore system. Um, I have this already pre-made so you guys can all witness how it works. Yeah, I'm going to go myself to survival mode, to F game mode, that's and I'll show you guys how it works. So when I mine these ores, see, this gives me limestone, and when I mine this, it gives me lava stone. <laughs> I just thought it was two stupid things. Because I'm not gonna name it. Also, if you're wondering what this is, this is just for another tutorial. I was just testing something out. So that may be a tutorial in the future. Don't forget tomorrow's video, or maybe post it today. I'll be showing you guys how to make a simple GUI. It's like, when I mean simple, like, this is way more simple than the other GUI tutorial I made. It's still a little bit complex. But if you do decent with commands, but you don't want to do a, a GUI system like I did, this will probably make it way easier and make you understand a little bit more. So yeah. So let's begin. So you're going to want to get a structure block. If you don't know how to get a structure block, you're going to want to do slash give at p structure and then underscore block. And then you shall have been given a structure block. You're going to want to place two blocks like this. Put one down like that, and go into the structure block, and go into a setting, and remove all, of, all of them, and put them to one. After they're all set to one, you're gonna wanna name your structure block all one. And then you're gonna wanna get your all you want you want it to give you after you mine it. So I'm gonna give this one lava stone. So I'm just gonna drop the lava stone in there. New or one and then save it. Next thing you do is place down two command blocks like this. And the first one's gonna wanna be on uh, repeat unconditional always active and you wanna do slash execute at e name equals the or that you want it to play it to with. Mine is only concrete, it can be whatever you want. But whatever the name is, make sure it's in here and where it says orange concrete you have to be in this box right here. The three sticky lines and then slash structure load all one. So you have three lines, zero degrees. Next one you're gonna do is slash kill at e name each is on concrete. And after you've done that, you just wanna put yourself in survival mode. You mine it. And yay! You got you got the love stone. So yeah. Not all the one. Pretty simple at that. You so yeah, that's how you do it. Uh, I won't showcase how to do another one, but I, I will do, actually let me do that to make it because you really guys are gonna make more. So if you wanna make another one, you're gonna wanna go over to your P, this thing. You wanna set this to or two. So let's go in here, set it to or two. Go grab what you want it to be. Mine is limestone. You're gonna drop your limestone right in the the box. Do make sure all of them are set to one one one. And make sure it says or two right there, and then plus save a few times just to make sure you actually saved it. After you've done that, you're gonna want to go into a key command block, do the same exact thing you did last time, just n with a different or. I named it lime concrete, that's what you're gonna have to mine to get it. And you're gonna slash structure load or two, the circle line, circle line, circle line, zero degrees, and then you're gonna make sure it's on repeat, unconditional, always active, and then you're gonna do slash kill at e name equals lime concrete or whatever or, whatever, or you're making the mine and make sure it's on chain conditional or is active and then let me make sure i saved it and then i'm just gonna bring some down again glue got my diamond pickaxe and then mine it you see i'm getting the custom ores so yeah this is a really fun system to make um, this will probably be a good mine simulator, I'm guessing. Also, um, this is almost called this. This is like a beta version. I will, I, if you, actually, let me show you guys how to even make it so it gives you XP. So, if you want it to be giving you XP, you also want to, you want to do another command, okay? So, you're just gonna do it. It's like only one more command, okay, okay guys? If you want to give XP, so you're gonna want to add another command block, and then you want to do slash execute at e the name of your ore, 
and my ore is so this is when you mine it so mine is gonna be limes this is gonna be i think i let me go see what i need this i think it's like l6 and then i named it lava stone i do believe that's how i spelled it and then you're gonna wanna do flaw and then you wanna do summon and then I'm not gonna just do this in a command block, let me just break that and put it right back so I'll summon xp bottle and then you're gonna do that uh, so if you do that if I spelled everything correctly, or if I probably didn't make a mistake, it should, in fact. So I'm, I'm gonna place on this, do that. Back on that. So you see, you get XP from it as well. So if I want to just so let's test that again. So if you do this, see, I have a lot of these. See, and now I'm over 18 by running all of it. So yeah. Really cool, really simple. If you just if you want to make it give you XP, just add this command and make sure it's the name of the ore you give it. Like the ore that you're dropping to mine was like lava stone. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. This was a really fun to create. Like I said before, this is why we be using our mine simulators and stuff. Um, or like a realm that has a mine sim. No, I don't know. So yeah. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and comment down below what you guys want me to do in a future video. My next video will be a simple DUI, like I said before. And thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye!